So my, my name is Andrew Drysdale. Uh, for the last eight uh, years, I've been the head uh, boys and girls cross country and uh, track and field distance coach here. Um, and it's been a, uh, just a tr tremendous experience. It's been, it's been a great experience in that regard. Uh, it, uh, taking over the program was, was, was unexpected and, and uh, the, uh, the events that led to me uh, kind of being thrust into the situation with the, with, with the program. Um, so really, I was in, a, in, an, in an essence learning as I went along with, with, with the program, uh, having never had been a head coach before. Um, but I think what really gave me the most, the most guidance, the most, the most um, oh, what's the word I want to use here, but the most imp impact um, was not necessarily the sport itself and, and the structures of coaching the sport, but really the community of the school uh, and the way that the school embraced, embraced myself, embraced our program, um, and the kids and the families within the program uh, really embraced us too. That's really what I think helped me grow uh, and, and evolve as not just a, as a coach, but a, as a person, uh, you know, an, an educator, a mentor, but really just from the bottom up to the top, just as a person as a whole. Uh, I know that they're in the best of hands, but I'm going to miss the kids. Uh, and secondly, I'm also, also absolutely going to miss the coaches that I've worked with here. Um, we've assembled a great staff, uh, uh, both within cross country and with track, and they're, they're great to work with every day, to spend time with, to hang out with. Uh, and they're people that I consider to be friends now, too. We, we go to each other's kids' birthday parties and, and, go, and have barbecues, and they are actual friends, not just coworkers, not just colleagues. Uh, and so those relationships will stay, but we won't get to have the time, you know, that, that we had before. And those, I think those two things are the hardest things to leave behind here at Regis Jesuit. Oh, they're going to accomplish great things. And like I said, uh, you know, it's going to be a little bittersweet on my end to, to watch the success that they have. Uh, the boys' team is incredibly young and incredibly talented, uh, and the girls' team is the same way. Uh, there's a lot of potential, a lot of talent, um, and again, they've got great leadership coming in with Coach uh, Balzer and Coach Boyle. Um, Coach Balzer knows the program. Coach Boyle has a great track record of success in coaching, um, and they're going to. It's sky's the limits. Um, they're going to do things that and achieve things that they didn't they ever did when I was the coach. Um, and that's a good thing. Uh, it means that I left the program you know, better than I found it. And it's going to be even better uh, down the road. I think it's going to be uh, amazing to watch uh, the program grow, evolve, watch the numbers grow. And it's, it's going to be kind of fun to, to see kids go, uh, especially the kids that I'm leaving here, those freshmen, sophomores, juniors, and watch how much more they improve this year to next year. It's going to be fun. This is Zane Wilson and Sam Wolpert for RJTV.